Hello, my name is Andy and I am the Village Idiot Mom with a car and a GoPro and an unhealthy amount of time on my hands. I am beginning this one on yet another bridge and this is a bridge I am very familiar with because it's over a river and that is the River Trent below me and that forms the boundary here between not just a parish but also two districts and two districts which you guys know quite a lot about already. That way that's the town of Gainsborough and that is in West Lindsay. But today we're in Bassett Law because I'm going to explore the village of Sornby. That's interesting about Beckingham Flood Reservoir, isn't it? I mean, this road, this is called the Flood Road. And the amount of times I've driven on this, it's ridiculous. I, I, I've, I've lost count. I've never known why it's been called the Flood Road before. But I guess now I do. So it's not just a one horse town, Sornby. There isn't just the one road. There is another one as well, which is Marsh Lane, which is right there. I'm gonna have a little explore down there in a moment. I've never been down there before, so I don't know what I'm gonna find. Uh, but this is the main road through the village. This is the one that leads down towards North and South Wheatley and towards places like Bowl and West Burton. And if you go that way, that takes you back towards Beckingham and of course the Flood Road and Gainsborough. Okay, so I'm gonna have a little wander around this part of the village now uh, and then uh, move down towards where the church is. So 
so this is pretty cool actually uh, i've left my phone in the car at the moment so i can't take a, a photo of this but this is uh, this shows how many councillors each uh, parish in bassett law has and look at old Sornby there it only has two uh, there was one i spotted with one uh, yeah bevercoats up there look bevercoats only has one uh, the biggest one seems to be Cartley Lindrick with 15, Tuxford with 15. That's quite cool. Oh, Howarth and Burkhurst have got 15 as well. That's really good. That's really good. Now the interesting thing about this church is how to access it because to get to it you have to go through a private farmyard which is just there. Now I did the sensible thing and I asked uh, if I could access the church before I came here because it wasn't clear on the map and uh, it appears that's the only way to get to it. It's public access to actually get to it. Uh, but of course, to do that, you have to go through the private farmyard. So always best to ask uh, before you attempt to visit something like this. And there you go, that to be honest is the parish of Sornby. There's nothing much more than what I've shown you apart from what's in today's picture bit. And that's coming at you right now. And there you go, that's the parish of Sornby. A very short one for you today, but that's how the cookie crumbles. Some are big and some are small. And in fact, the next one I'm going to in this district is very similar to Sornby in terms of size. It's a very small village and I'm heading there 
right now. And you can see where that is if you tune into the channel next Thursday at half past two. But until then, this has been the Parish of Sornby, and I've been Andy, also known as the Village Idiot, and I'm out.